a Thanksgiving project, writing, mailing appreciation letters. Parents, today we are going over a very special and meaningful project that you can do with your child. We are going to show you the steps that Aiden did, and hopefully you can mirror and modify to fit your child. Before we start, please remember to like this video and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. The subscription is absolutely free to you, but it means the world to us. Thank you so much. Let us get started. It is a tradition, about a week before Thanksgiving, Aiden starts to write his appreciation letter to his family and his teacher. Because it takes a long time to complete a letter, we do that in two separate days. What you doing? I'm writing the thank you letter for my teacher. Great. He also colors a Thanksgiving themed picture that we hang on the wall during the holidays. We would hope that you would do something similar with your child. If your child cannot write just yet, coloring and or drawing to make a thank you card can be a very good alternative. For your reference, a letter to his sister that he wrote last year on the left side. On the right was the letter he wrote to his teacher this year. Unfortunately, the letter to his family could not be taken as it was kept in secret by Aiden and his teacher. This is our second year doing this project with Aiden. He had so much fun doing that project and he did so great. We went to the post office to drop off the mail. After a couple days, we walked to the mailbox to retrieve the mail together. At Thanksgiving dinner, he read out his letter to his mother. It was so great and so touching. We all cried with joys. This year, he did even better. He combined letters to daddy, mommy, and sister into one letter. He wrote the second letter to his teacher. He knows that we need to put the farm end to information, as well as where to place the stamps. We put on the envelope to mail. We put on the address and the stamp to where do we put the stem? We put the stem on the top right. Are you ready to go to postal office now? Yes, I am. Very good, let's go. It was a cold and windy morning. We bundled up and headed to the same post office as last year. We chose this particular location because it is very nice inside and have room for us to work with Aiden. Aiden was very familiar with the spots where he took picture last year. He knew exactly what we needed to do. We are at the post office. Oh, uh, what are we doing here? We are sending the letters to my family and my teacher. Very good. Can you go ahead and put it in the box? And then you close it? And now, now you can check it. Make sure. Is it dropped? Yes, right? Very good. Our artistic children need hands-on experience to learn better. Therefore, this project is really, really good in my opinion. I really hope you and your child can start this year. If it is too late to send through postal service, you can still take the child there. We just will not drop into the drop box. If that is done, one Thanksgiving day, you would just place the letters inside your mailbox and walk the kid to retrieve the mail. Whatever works best for you and your child, but similar project is highly recommended. Thank you for watching this video. Be sure to share with us your wonderful project through Enabling Autism Group. Link in the description. See you on the next video. Happy Thanksgiving!